Alrighty, guys. So we are doing a plush review on the DC's Comics or DC's Justice League Wonder Woman plush I got for Walmart three days ago. Um, yeah, they're like six dollars and ninety-seven cents. You only get like five of these characters in the plushies, like Cyborg, Superman, um, Batman, Wonder Woman, and Flash. And I just got Wonder Woman because she looks cool. So, yeah. Um, what's really weird? This is she doesn't have her skirts. Like, if y'all know in the comics, like the Rebirth comics, like the newer comic books of Wonder Woman, she is wearing a skirt now that's supposed to be inspired by the Gal Gadot Wonder Woman from the movies. But I guess in this one, they just made it look like the classic Wonder Woman look. But anyway, guys, let's go ahead and take the tags off and see what she looks like without the tags on. Here's the tag. You can see the WB logo and DC Comics logo and the Just Play logo. Now, this plushie is really small. And what's really cool... She can sit down like the Disney plushies and the Marvel plushies, too. But anyway, guys, this plush review is going to get 100 out of 100. And yes, like I said, I got this from Walmart three days ago. But anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe. Alrighty, guys. So, yes, I'm using the same thumbnail and title from the video, but the title is just going to be saying Remake in the title of the video that y'all are watching me right now. So, yep, we are unboxing the Walmart-exclusive Funko Pop, or Pop Hallmark Ornaments Peacemaker. Um, yes, I rebought this last week, and now it's finally here. Let's go ahead and take them. Oh, I did not mean to rip the box out of the box and see if it's okay. You. It broke on me. Wow. Well, okay, guys. So, yeah. Um, I got out of the box. Um, yes, I just replaced this. And I am a little upset it broke on me. I mean, come on, man. I just replaced this last week and just got it in person when my brother was on vacation all the way from North Carolina and now it's broke. Here's the head. But don't worry, I might probably super glue it back. After this unboxing. But anyway guys. This unboxing plus review is going to get a 6 out of a 10. Because it broke. But anyway guys. This is for June's unboxing. But anyway guys. Like. Comment. Subscribe. Oh man. It has been a month since I did my unboxing. I. Hold on. There we go, I shut my door. Yes, finally I am filming my one of my unboxings for June early. Let's see what it is in three, two, one. ASMR time. The receipt, which I don't know why I showed you. Here it is. Yep. It is Death Rising 2 on the PlayStation 3. Um, yes, I just want to make sure everything is here. Little booklet. The disc and everything else. And since it includes a map, which I don't see the map in the game, I mean in the case. But yeah, this unboxing and review is going to get 100 out of 100. And I bought this just a couple days ago. But yes, um, before I end the video, I bought this on Luki Games for like 13 bucks. And I'm glad I got it in my um PlayStation 3 collection because I never played Death Rising. But anyway, guys, like, 
comment, subscribe. Okay, guys, I am doing another June's unboxing, early June unboxing, and I can't wait to show you guys what it is. Yes, it is. Here it is. The Deadpool and Wolverine Creature I bought from Bleacher Creatures last week. Get out the bag. Wow. That is really cool. Um, give me a minute. Alrighty, guys. So yeah, check this out. Um, what's really cool, he has the katana swords on the back. This little pointy here. I don't know why they messed that up, but I guess that's their mistake at their end. So yeah, let's go ahead and take the tag and hanger off, shall we? In three, two, one. Here is the tag. Sadly, it just says Deadpool, not Deadpool and Wolverine. So yeah, um, this plush unboxing and review is going to get a hundred out of a hundred. I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe.